Hey guys, uh, as promised, a quick tutorial. Uh, this is one of my favorite tips um, for when you're creating a composite and you want to make your subject look like they're in the grass or um, in, in some sort of um, you know forest or what have you. If you can see here, she is completely cut out, but when you put her on the grass, she looks like she's just been stuck there. Same with the giraffe here. Um, I deleted the mask to show you guys. So you're going to put a mask on the subject. Then you're going to go up to your brushes, and this is the new layout for the 2018. You're going to scroll down to, it's a default brush, if I can find it, the grass brush here, defaults at 134. Select that, but you're not done. You're going to go over to your brush settings, and you're going to unclick or uncheck the color dynamics. It's very important. If you don't, it will not act like a mask brush. It will actually color onto your subject. So you unclick the color dynamics, go back to the mask, make sure your brush is on black, and check your opacity. I use the brackets to increase the size of mine, and then that's all you do. Look at that. She is suddenly in the grass. Same with the giraffe. Let's go over to the sitting giraffe. I will delete the layer mask. I will add a new one in there. Make sure you're in black. Make sure your brush is 200. Make sure your settings are unchecking. And, and that won't, won't go back every time you use it. Um, until, until you switch brushes, just check it. And then there you go. Paint it right on. Paint it right on. And then suddenly, your subjects don't look like they are pasted in. They look like they're there. That's it for today. And I will be also sharing an inner shadow secret for lighting that I use all the time. So stay tuned.